so I've just filmed a few of the lovely gifts and some lovely things. Luckily you can tweak these fittings. Some nice yeah. lovely bits and bobs. Uh, which lovely cashmere scarf. I tried out one of I don't know if it's focusing so well there. Uh, We've had to make do with existing furniture because our sofa from Barker and Stonehouse hasn't arrived and we have no sofas in here which I was explaining. The Hi everyone, Happy New Year to you. I hope you've enjoyed the celebrations last night if you decided to join in. A um, little bit different this year. But still, it's a new year and a new opportunity to get the best from life. 365 days, new chapter. And I know it's uh, in lockdown here in, in England anyway, um, which has its challenges. But it is a good time just to take a little bit of time to think about what we're going to do, what we want to get out of this year. And I was trying to think about... Um, my channel and, and what I would want from it and the kind of ethos that that underpins everything that um, ho I'm hoping to share with you and there's a Latin term meliore which means about being positive and things can only get better and um, life will improve that sort of thing and I thought that's really the kind of lifestyle issues that I want to um, share with you and things that I'll be doing. That's the kind of underlying vibe and ethos um, that I think we'll have. So I was thinking of including that in my um, name and possibly website etc. So um, that, that yeah that's my thoughts. The, I do have some reservations because I'm not sure if it's a commonly known name or whether um, people search for that but that's my thinking at the moment and I'm going to be working on that now that we've gone into lockdown I've got more time but it's New Year's Day I've come upstairs to the living room um, which I've shown you before because it's it's a sort of before situation I think I mentioned the sofa's yet to arrive it's rescheduled now for the 7th of January so hopefully it will come but um, it's, and I don't spend a lot of time in here because it, it's not really set up as a living room at the moment. But I'm not one of these people that takes the tree down um, straight away on New Year's Day. I like the lights on on an evening. I think it's nice to have um, as a feature. So I'm going to show you what I can see um, in the room. And I've still got the decorations up. Not that there's many in here, but they're lovely. From Niche Living in Barnard Castle. Just nicely dangling in the warmth. You can see how dark it is outside. And then the lovely tree. Getting you in focus there. I have had the television on, been watching a little bit of Game of Thrones today last um the last series with that epic um I, where I uh, defeats the blue eyed baddie so yeah quiet day today um but I think tomorrow I'll crack on with the YouTube channel and you'll eventually get to see some of the content I've been making. I was watching a Think uh, Media presentation, it's an American channel, and he was kind of advising to go for it because um, when we watch YouTube, if particularly if like me, you're just starting out, you're not sure what, what you're doing and how it's going to be well, whether it's going to be received or not. Um, there's a real hesitancy there and what you sort of want, you want it to be perfect and you want it to go out looking absolutely right but what we're watching most of the time is seasoned presenters, content creators who've been doing this for some time and you know they're really brilliant at it already um, but uh, what Think was saying is really you need to bite the bullet and start uploading 
and um, let the algorithm do a little bit of work and even if you're not ready just start loading up your content because it's like everything else um, you get better the more you practice the more confident you get and the more familiar you are with technology and with the lighting etc so I think that's what we're going to do uh, take a deep breath and um, set off get some content uploaded at the beginning of lockdown and hopefully my channel will be uh, that I've found useful is watching others like Josie and Lydia um, during quiet times where in lockdown there's, there's not a lot going on but you can still feel a connection with other people and that's what I'd like to do um, for others so that that's part of the the point of doing the vlog is to share time with others and share some of the activities that I like doing with others um, so that's what we're going to do during during the time that I've got now um, which could probably be the whole of January who knows but let's make the best of it that's my um, approach that's what I'm hoping I've got dressed today got my jeans on not lounging around in pajamas although I know it's very tempting got ready did my hair which I want to show you in some of the other vlogs about things I want to do to improve my hair probably not gonna have good services around for a little while but um, yeah just kind of beauty things things like that I've put a little bit of fake tan on try and get a little bit of a glow on the skin gets an awful lot harder <laughs> as you get older <laughs> to, to look your best um, but I think it's worth the effort if you can if you feel like it you want to get up get ready put your clothes on and feel as if you're getting into the day might help with the, the mental attitude so I'm all about that um, trying to do the best we can in the circumstances so yeah so I shall see you um, probably tomorrow I'm going to take the wreath down tomorrow and because I ran out of time I bought some new things online some cones and some um, seed heads and some beautiful feathered uh, feathered pieces some uh, lovely brown feathers and I wanted to put them up but by the time they arrived by the time I had so any free time which was basically very little running up to Christmas um, the wreath had gone up and I didn't have time to do it so I've decided to pop them on and then when it goes into storage um, it will be as it is ready for next year there's some new velvet ribbon I've ordered as well um, that should arrive and I can pop that on so hopefully um, we'll do that together and um, and see see how that looks as a new a new um, a new wreath for next year so I'd love to share that with you and we'll get underway with that tomorrow if all the bits are here so thanks for joining me and as I say happy new year let's make the best of it and I look forward to seeing you next time Thank you.